In this session, I am going to show you how you can take advantage of the Zoho system and let your employees check in, check out, or clock in, clock out using the Zoho system. I will show you two different scenarios. Scenario number one, that you can do it using Zoho Click, which lots of people are using, and the other one will be using Zoho People. Okay? Now, the advantage of uh, uh, using a Click or Zoho People is that both of them are using in the back end, they're using Zoho People. So your database is only one, even though you can do it from two different places. Before I start this session, I just want to say that I had some negative interaction with a few people from the community. They contacted our company and they requested that I will answer them uh, on email questions. And when uh, my company told them that the free uh, work that we're doing on YouTube, free webinars, free forums, whatever we do for the community, which ends up with uh, 20 hours per week. Uh, it's not also happening in my company. In my company, everything is built. It's a company for profit, okay? Not non-profit. And they were very, very upset. So I just want to manage expectations. All the work that I'm doing uh, for the community, which is half of my work week, free of charge. I don't charge anything for it. This is free of charge from me to you and I'm enjoying every second of it. I enjoy the feedback that I'm getting back from you and I also enjoy what I do, okay? Whatever I do in my corporation, which means I'm consulting companies, this is paid services. So for me, it makes sense and I wanted to manage this expectation to make sure that you will not be upset about what I'm doing, right? Okay, let's begin. First of all, I want to show you Zoho Click. Whenever you log to Zoho Click, on the left top, you will see remote work. Now, if you don't see remote work, probably the Zoho people is not installed on your Zoho One. So please go ahead, go to one.zoho.com and click on admin panel and then click on applications. And from here, you will click on add application and you will add Zoho people to your Zoho one. And let's see where it is. Okay, you see that in my case, it's already added, but in your case, maybe you will see add button and you will need to add Zoho people. Whenever you will click on remote work, you will be able to switch it on. And then the system will ask you how you like to configure your remote work. And you can have your different type of scenarios to check in and check out and what's happening during this time. So you can set it up from here. From that moment on, every time that you have the remote work on the right side of the screen, you will see check in. When you click on check in, the timer will start to run. And whenever you finish working, you can click on check out and the timer will stop. In order to see the, the reports, of who logged in, logged out, how many hours, you will need to click here on the picture and then you need to click on the admin panel. And on the bottom of the screen, under reports, you will see remote work. And the remote work can give you different type of reports. Uh, one of the reports is by user. And of course, for me, it's empty, right? I just uh, activated it. But based on uh, the user section, you will be able to see different reports for all the people in your company. And you can also see reports based on departments, okay? You can also go to attendance, and in the attendance, you will have more reports. You can also change the, the time. And you can say, for example, everything in the last week or a different type uh, of uh, scenario. Another way that you can do the clock in clock out will be so people you will need to navigate to the attendance and from the attendance you will see that you can check in on the right side and when you finish work you click on check out please also note that the so people has a very nice applications for employees once you log in from your smartphone to so people you will be able to clock in, clock out in a very nice big button. It's very simple. And it also 
you know, it's nicer for employees. I found that employees really like to use the mobile applications. So you just click in, clock out using the, the application and all the data is of course coming to your system. From the attendance area, you will be able to click on the reports and you will be have your different type of reports based on uh, the, the report that you like to have. You can see how much time, for example, Dior Isaac worked. You can see the day, you can see everything here, okay? And of course, you can change it based on different people and each person that you have here, you can see the hours that he worked, okay? That's it. So I hope I was able to give you some value here and you know, it's another thing that you can take advantage of Zo. Why not? You're paying the license and Zo wants you to enjoy everything that they have to offer. And this is one of them, okay? So thank you very much for watching this session. If you like the session, thumbs up is always appreciated. If you have any questions, comments, shoot them in the comments below. I will see you in Wednesday morning on our free webinar. See you next time.